clean the hub up, as you can see inside there, I pay particular attention to our bearing surfaces where our needle, where our rollers run on the, on the coupling cone. I'm shining there with the light. You can see all that there's some, there's no pitting. We're looking for pitting on that surface where the rollers run. Okay. The other thing I've done is I've got all my bearings cleaned up. Okay. As you can see there. And when you have a look at your bearing, you need to shine a light. And you can see those two rollers, two rollers there and there. You look in between those rollers, and you look in with a torch. You want to have a look at that surface where the other, where this roller runs on the bearing, and the other side of it runs in there. Now I'm going to try and pack the bearing, show you the correct way to pack a wheel bearing while I'm videoing. So just try and bear with me here. I'm hoping my hand here is in the setup area it is. <coughs> so here's my bearing grease, high temperature bearing grease. Anything to use in a bearing. What I do is a scoop. Show my hands. Not clean enough. I scoop some grease out. I put it in the palm of my hand like that. And I get my bearing and I push this open area here into the grease. Just taking little bites at a time. And I keep doing that. There's different ways to do it. What I'm aiming for is you can see the grease now being squeezed out between the rollers on the opposite side. So I now know there's grease right through here. And I continue around my bearing until I've done that all the way around my bearing. Right, it's coming through there again now. Move around. Next part. Okay. And I continue doing that around the bearing until that's all the way packed. I'll do that for both bearings, okay? Then I'm going to pack the hub and I'll show you how to put it back together.